Hi everyone and welcome to Triple M Adventures with Bill. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon, which will help me produce more content in the future. Now this video is about your startup sound. I'm going to show you in this video how to make a startup sound so you can change it from OpenTX and then install it on your radio so that when you turn your radio on, you get the new startup. I don't actually use this. I like the OpenTX one, but um, we're all different. So I want to make a video to show you how to do this. So let's switch over to the computer. Firstly, let's go and take a look at the program I use to make the sound. The one that I use is Audacity. Okay, first thing we need to do in here is to go and change from the microphone to internal recording, which we did stereo mix. And then we it's we necessary for us to change the project hertz. So we have to bring it down to 32,000. So the project rate should be 32,000. So now we should be ready to go. Now we need to go to this website, which is ttsdemo.com. Now you can see I've already typed in the sound that I want, and you can see the doggies following my cursor. Cool. And so what we now need to do, once we've typed that, and you can choose whichever, I've used a silly one just for my example, but you can go to here, that's adult voices and children's voices and then the offbeat voices. Then we need to go back to Audacity and we push record, it starts recording. Then we go back here and we push save. Now we need to go back to Audacity and push stop. Now the next thing is we need to get rid of this space. I've already done videos on making sounds, but I just want to go through it again for this particular application where we're using it to make up our startup sound. So once you've done this, we push edit and we delete. That gets rid of the end. Leave a bit of a gap though. Don't bring it really close to the end because it doesn't sound so good in your radio. Okay, we drag this across to about there and edit, delete. And there we go. Right, you can see from up here that we it's not as loud as it could be. So what we're going to do is alter that to, let's say, 10 to start off with. We just want it to peak. That should be good. So go back to the beginning. Now what we need to do is hit file, export, and we're going to export that as a wave. Now we need to, I've already got a file called hello. The file needs to be called hello to go into your radio so that it's the startup. So I'm just going to copy that to you, just name it hello. So save, I'm just going to replace that. Now let's put the new opening sound onto our radio. I'm going to plug the transmitter into the computer, push USB storage. You can hear our computer has detected it. Now the first thing we're going to get do is go to the USB drive and go to sounds, then into English, and then to system. Now what we need to do is change, I would suggest you do this, we change the name of the hello file let me find it hello and rename it old so I, all i did is edited it and called it old then we need to go to our downloads where i have got the new file right click that copy it and then go into your system folder on your sd card and then paste it into there and that's how we get the sound onto your radio thanks for watching this video and if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up 
And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comment section below because I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.